Hey, welcome back everybody. This is another TTM video. We get autographs TTM or through the mail. It's a big part of our channel. It's not all we do, of course, but it is a big part. We try to put on uh, at least two through the mail autograph videos per week. And this is no exception. We've got eight. Let's get right to it. So I don't gab and waste all your time today. First one's coming from Kansas City, Missouri. Kansas City, here I come. Jim Eisenreich, no index cards, very fine Sharpie, look at that, 91 score, same five, he signed all five, very similar autograph, very consistent, 92 tops, 92 Donruss, 91 upper deck, and 94 upper deck, pretty sweet. Gave him a donation to his foundation, which is uh, goes to help victims or sufferers of Tourette syndrome, which is what Mr. Eisenreich was diagnosed with. Actually ended up missing two years of his baseball career. He's 61 years old. He played for 15 seasons, 82 to 84. And then he was diagnosed, missed a couple years, and played again from 87 to 98. And did very well just about everywhere he went. Always hit hit. 290 career hitter. Played for five teams altogether. World Series champ. Not with these Phillies, but with the Marlins in 97. I think he played within the World Series with the Phillies, maybe. Won it with the Marlins in 97. He was on second base when um, Luis Gonzalez got the base hit off of Mariano Rivera. $10 donation, five cards. Um, I don't know if he has a prescribed amount. That's what I sent, five cards, $10. Got those back in nine days. Next one's coming from Reno, Nevada. It's got to be the home run champ. Don't get too many from Reno. It, it is. Didn't put him back in the hard card. 73 tops and 81 tops. Nice. Dave Kingman. I think he was a donation, too. Not sure. 72 years old. Played outfield, first base, DH. Played 71 to 86. I'm going to feature that 73 tops. Like that set, always have. Young Dave Kingman there on his way to 442 lifetime home runs. Pure, pure slugger. <laughs> Averaged a home run every 15 at bats. Led the league in home runs twice. And then a three-time All-Star. 15 days. I think there was a $5 fee per 15 days. I know he signs for free for a few people. I've seen that come back. Next one's coming from Macon, Georgia. Macon Bacon. There's Manny Fernandez, 73 tops. Two times over. Sit 273 tops. Got a great signature. Got a little cloudy on that one, if you can see. Sharpie got a little runny. Manny Fernandez, 17-0 in the loop of his Y. Very cool signature. There's a great player for you, 73 tops. Yeah, he's 74 years old. Played for eight years, 68-75, all for those Miami Dolphins, where he was a two-time Super Bowl champ, Super Bowl seven and eight. Played in three in a row. Cowboys took a ring from him in Super Bowl six. But, uh, yeah, he was a monster in Super Bowl Seven. 17 tackles and a sack. Should have won the MVP. They gave it to Jake Scott. But uh, maybe they should have shared it, if anything. 35 sacks in his great career. Dolphin Stadium honor roll, 2014. Big, big event for him. 10 days, no fee for the great autograph, Manny Fernandez. Next one's coming from Pittsburgh, PA. Pittsburgh... P.A. No, two more. Oh, he didn't sign that. Sid Bream. He'll sign whatever you send him for a dollar a piece. Gives you a Bible verse. I got three different Bible, or four different Bible verses. John 16, 33. John 3, 36. 1 John 4, 10. And Romans 5, 8. Two of those on the 86 tops. His rookie card is 85, I believe, with the Doyers. The Los Angeles Doyers, where he came up. 
It came over in a trade for Bill Madlock, I believe, was involved in that trade. Sid Bream, who spent his entire career with the Pirates. <coughs> if he did play for another team, he would have been out at home in a uh, hypothetical playoff game, if it did happen. But he didn't, and he was out at home. Anywho, charges $1 each. Four cards, $4. 12-year career. Played first base. Solid player for the Buckos. Team leader for the Buckos. Seven days, $1 each. Next one's coming from Atlanta Metro. Sid was out at home. Fred Marion. Not Francis Marion, the Swamp Fox. It's Fred. One, two, and three. He gave a Bible verse on his middle card on the Pacific. Philippians 4.13. Nice. Puts his number up there in the loop, much like Manny Fernandez. Puts the 17 and 0. 91 Pro Set. Great card. Full bleed photography. A rarity back then. 89 Pro Set. Another great card. We're going to feature the one with the Bible verse. 91 Pacific. Fred Marion, 62 years old. He played safety. Long time. 10 seasons in the NFL. 82 to 91. All for those New England Patriots. You can see there he was a big tackle stats for a safety. 119, 861 for his career there. Really a solid player. Pro bowler in 85. Had 29 career interceptions. He's on the Patriots all 1980s team. He's on their 35th anniversary team and their 50th anniversary team. Really good player for a long time. Kind of unheralded. Fred Marion. 19 days, no fee. Dave Kingman's getting blocked out. Next one's coming from San Diego, California. Great city. Love that place. Love to get back to it. Merv Rettman, I sent him a team card. He did sign that right at the bottom there. That's pretty sweet. Where is he in that photo? Number 14, right in the middle. And 74 tops. Merv Rettman looks just like his uh, 72 and 73 tops. He had three cards in a row with that little bat flip. And then the 79 tops with the Angels. We remember him with the Royal Orioles where he came up and then put that team card out front there. It's pretty cool. Featured that 74 tops. Orioles and the Reds. So he won a couple World Series. He played for three in a row with, with the Orioles, 69, 70, and 71. They won it in all in 1970. Then he was traded to the Reds and he won one with them in 75. And then as a coach, he became a coach for about 25 years, and he won another World Series with the A's in 1989. Pretty good player. Seven days, quick return, no fee, Merv Redmond. Put him right back there. You think about that. Last one coming from South Jersey. South Jersey, New Jersey. He even taped the uh, corners of my envelope. Self stick sometimes doesn't stick. There's Leroy Kelly. Nice. Hall of Famer. 72 tops. He's getting up there. He's 78 years old. He charges $5 each. Hall of Fame in 1994, as you see there. Great career with the Cleveland Browns. First two seasons didn't play much. Wonder why? Well, he was backing up the greatest player of all time, Jim Brown. Played as a backup. Then he took over after Jim Brown retired kind of suddenly. Ran 3,000 yards three years in a row. Led the NFL in rushing two times. He's on the 1960s All-Decade team. Six times in the Pro Bowl. Finished with 7,200 lifetime rushing yards, which at the time he retired was fourth all-time. 74 touchdowns in his career. Hall of Fame in 94. 18 days. $5 fee for Hall of Famer Leroy Kelly. That's it. Eight. Rather quick. Give me a thumbs up if you like it quick. That's what she said. Um, eight returns. We won't even go over them. Leave a comment down below. Let me know what your favorite was. If you haven't subscribed yet, please subscribe. That way you'll be notified of all my future videos when you hit that bell. And if you missed the last TTM video from last week, check it out right there with a the one click. Hey, thanks for watching and we'll see you soon.